Hey there, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a poll in a meeting in Microsoft Teams. So let's go ahead and let's get started. Polls in Microsoft Teams meetings are actually just um, surveys that are created in Microsoft Forms. And so to go ahead and get started, what you wanna do is you wanna click on the chat button or the show conversation button in your meeting window and you want to scroll down to below the compose box and you want to click on the messaging extensions that's these uh, three dots here and what this is going to do is bring up a list of the apps that you can use in a microsoft teams meeting and we're going to go ahead and we're going to click on forms here and this is where you can actually come to create a quick little poll a poll is essentially a question so let's go ahead and just put in a, a test question here which is how is this meeting going so far and you can fill out your options so i'm just going to keep it simple and say good and bad if you wanted to add additional options you could just click on the add option and if you want to allow multiple answers then you can toggle this multiple answers button um, and you can easily delete any of these options just by clicking on the garbage can now, before I save this, there's also two other options here. So you can share the results of this poll automatically after voting, and you can also choose to make responses anonymous. So I'm gonna go ahead and check keep responses anonymous. And now what we wanna do is click on the save button here. And so Microsoft uh, Forms is going to give you a preview of, of what your poll will look like. So you can see here it says I've created a poll and it's saying that the results will be anonymous and we're going to share these results and you see your two options there. Okay, um, so you can choose to edit this before you're sending in case you realize you made a mistake. Uh, this looks good to me so I'm going to go ahead and click on the send button. And what this is going to do is this is actually going to send this in the meeting chat and you'll also notice these little pop-ups as well to indicate that um, this poll has been created. Okay, uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna close these and I'm going to submit my vote. So I'm just going to check my response option and click on submit vote. And there you go, I can see the responses in real time and so can the other participants because we chose to share those results. So that's how to create a poll in a Microsoft Teams meeting. Um, now what I'm gonna do is I am going to go ahead and just end this meeting as well. One of the cool things about um, polls is that the actual results will also persist after the meeting is concluded. And so to view them, you wanna click on your chat and you wanna come into your meeting record and you can actually see the results of that survey and the survey um, in the chat. So um, handy little trick to be able to go back and reference this. So that's how to create a poll in a Microsoft Teams meeting. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like it, please drop a comment below. And if you wanna stay up to date on the latest Microsoft Teams tutorials, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for stopping by, talk soon.